these Canaanites can't go up and park. They was talking about uh, American niggas. They said American niggas in, in some bullshit, in their bullshit tongue. Who's that about that? Look at this. Right. No, they were saying um, cotton picking, uh, cotton picking niggas. Yeah. Cotton picking niggas. Yeah, they got, I forget the word for they had for that. They got a special word. I can't in remember it. what it was now. They got a special derogatory term. You probably get Google it. Right. And they look down on us like they better than us and shit. Or Especially on Jake's from Ghana yeah. and Nigeria. They look down on us here, man. Like we ain't shit. You know? And they Israelites too. That's a cur that's a, that's a curse though. All Israel against each other. Pentecost was fully come, they were all with one accord in one place, and suddenly there came a sound from heaven as a rushing mighty wind, and it filled all the house where they were sitting, and there appeared unto them cloven tongues like as a fire, and it sat upon each of them, and they were all filled with the Holy Ghost, and began to speak with other tongues as the Spirit gave them utterance. Yeah, they go, this is, this is going today, so they can understand each other too. Yeah. Uh, just a little bit more. It's uh, 5, Acts 2 and 5 says, And there were dwelling at Jerusalem Jews, devout men, out of every nation. Oh, that's a good point, too. All right, because, right, they say it's after uh, Pentecost. But, in that, uh, but it was talking about, because you had, like I said, there was Jews out of every nation. But that's talking about those Israelites who were scattered among all nations. And But when they all came together right there, they was all speaking different languages. And then they, they started, everybody could understand each other because they got hit with that Holy Spirit. Uh, but, but people say superpowers ain't in the Bible. It's not that a superpower to be able to understand all languages. Who do you know can understand every language? That's, that's, that's a small percentage of people in the world. That's a small percentage of people that know so many fucking languages. Like a rain man. Right, right. They had to study. That was the spirit. Yeah. Just like how we received the truth, the spirit gave us woke us up and sit on simple ass down in front of that computer and learn the word, you know, learn the precepts, watch me apostles, man. That's yep. the spirit that does that, man. It ain't nothing, it ain't nothing we doing it on our own, man. Like all the skills we got was from the spirit. That's right. It says, verse 6, and when they was noised abroad, abroad, it's like that, the multitude came together and were confounded because that every man heard them speak in his own language. Mm. Yeah, every man heard it speak in his own language. That's crazy, man. That is crazy. People from all over, they were still hearing their tongue. <laughs> wow. But that's the same thing when the Lord comes back, man. All the nations, everybody going to be uh, know the truth then. Even the, but they still the condemned is going to be condemned. And they're going to be condemned through their mind, you know? Yeah. And they're going to know the truth. And they're going to know how they're going to feel like yep. shit, man. They're going to totally feel like shit. Man. Right before they get hit with that message. Yep, right, yep. Yep, and that's stuff the spirit that does. It ain't y'all that does. It ain't this goddamn devil in this universe. That's why this universal producer does it well a bunch of goddamn sheep. Retarded ass sheep, man. A bunch of dumb ass. It's simple as I think universities in this world, man. And all these problems, they can't come together and fix not one problem. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. All the collective minds together to fix one problem. Clowns. They make them more problems, shit. Exactly. Ain't nothing but uh, women up in the universities. A bunch of bird brain dumbass hoes. Oh, oh that be, 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 be too bad. <laughs> yeah. And you talk to any of them students at these colleges, they they dumb, they dumb as hell. Literally, they are, man. What they say, we ain't paying we the paying the dozens. We ain't paying the dozens, we just keeping it one hundred. <laughs> keeping it real, man. He's got a motherfucking degree, a master's degree, a social, a uh, bachelor's, a master's, or whatever the fuck is after that, and they think they somebody. My sister, she's like a nurse, kind of whatever. She's close to you know, shit, nurse, shit. Wow. She got sick. She don't know how to heal herself. <laughs> Laying the man covered up. Yeah. Like, <laughs> yeah, like, yeah. Like, that's some funny shit. You know? When y'all get all y'all, just like this truth, they can't get, get, get together. 
collectively and come against this truth. They gonna all get mowed down, man. Like blades of grass. That's how it is when that spiritual power comes. Um, 1 Corinthians 15, finish that out. 1 Corinthians 15 and 50. Now this I say, brethren, that flesh and blood cannot inherit the kingdom of the most high. Neither doth corruption inherit incorruption. Behold, I show you a mystery. We shall not all sleep, but we shall all be changed. In a moment, in, a, in the twinkling of an eye, this is all little, though. This is all little, when the spiritual power, when the Most High, he changed the elect. He gonna physically change the elect into gods again, man. You know, they're like watching the cartoons or movies of Superman, or Batman, or whatever, man. This is right here in the scriptures. This is what's gonna happen for real. It says, behold, I show you a mystery. We shall not all sleep, but we shall all be changed. In a moment, in the twinkling of an eye. Is that a bat? I, I didn't see it. I seen something fly I by. Probably was. Yeah. That was probably an old. Right, right, right. In the moment, in the twinkling of an eye, at the last trump, when the trumpet shall sound, and the dead oh, shall be raised incorruptible, and we shall be changed. For this corruptible must put on incorruption, and this mortal must put on immortality. Oh, I gotta look at the word. Go ahead, man. Oh, yeah, I was just about to say, too, like, uh, like back in the old days, like you read the book of Genesis, people lived to be 900 some years old. But the Most High took that away from us, because we've been wicked. Right? But soon we go into the kingdom, we're going to be changed. In the kingdom, we're gonna live forever. You know what I mean? That's right. That's right. Tell us, this is true because this, this, is a, this is a jellyfish that can, uh, you know, get old or whatever, but it can like reverse its age back to a baby. You know, you can kill that forever and ever. Right. The only way you can kill it is if you know, literally you kill it. You know, don't die in the moment. So if, that, if the Lord can do that to a jellyfish, you can do that to us. So right. there's, a, there's a frog, there's like, certain kinds of bugs. Yeah, turtles will live for, for that 200. Live yeah. forever, yeah. right longer than that. Yeah. That they freeze themselves, they get frozen, they literally frozen. And when, it, when they fall out, no matter how much later, man, they uh, just step off, you know, going about their business. You know, that's look crazy. At, man. Look at them trees. Well, how long a tree can live? Yeah, yeah. yeah they got trees that live like what, thousands of years old? They don't know. <laughs> yeah, they don't know, right? They don't know. They don't know. Here's important. It says deathless. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, because the word mortis means death in Latin. Mortis is where you get mortuary. That's where you get the word more. <laughs> means death. Yeah, it's yeah, that means death. Your oh, ass is in the morgue, in the mortuary. Right, right. That's the valley of uh, uh, the dry bone. You know what I mean? Right. It says deathless, undying. It says of gods. Of gods. Oh, shit, let me get that Of gods. Now, this is what the scriptures is going to do for the elect. He's going to make us gods again. We're still gods now. We just don't have the power. You know, like the scripture says, we're going to die like men. You know, we call like we're being wicked. But imperishable. Endless. All right, that's you know? eternal life. Endless. Endless. Everybody knows John 3.16. <laughs> right, they know it, but they don't know it. You know? Right, exactly. They don't understand it. Exactly. Exactly. That's when the Lord ain't dealing with you when you're just a Bible book or a scripture book. They, 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 they know like one or two scriptures. Right. And, and they, they don't it. understand them the right way. Now, I'll read this in that precept real quick. John 10 and 34. Yahweh Shai answered, because Yahweh Shai is the real name of Jesus. The Lord's name is not Jesus. That's an English word, okay? The Lord was a Hebrew Israelite. He spoke Hebrew. Yeah, sweet Jesus, baby. Yeah, how was I answered him? Uh, actually, my, my fault, I messed up. Yeah, how was I answered him? Is it not written in your law? I said, ye are gods. If he called them gods unto who the word of God came, and the scripture cannot be broken. That's clear and plain. And they were like, you ain't God. What you trying to say, you God? Here we are, God. Here we are in captivity. Here we are serving hard bondage, but we outshined all the other nations. Yep. Still. With our bummy, raggy clothes on, our raggedy ass homes, what the fuck ever, you know, we still out shining these goddamn man. Yep. They got all the wealth and all the, all, all, the, all, the, all the shit in the world, man, they still don't know. Who, who, who in the news right now? Everybody talking about LeBron James. Oh, shit. They, they, ain't, they ain't talking about motherfucking Esau, you know? What is that? What the fuck is that? <laughs> well, you see, you, 
boy LeBron went to the Lakers, right? That's crazy. That's all they talking about. They ain't talking about uh, no raggedy ass Edomite. Everybody's obsessed with Israelites. Camera hating on That's a luxury to have two cameras. Back in the day, we had one. Yeah, we did. It's right here, the last of them and all of them. Secondary is two and forty-four. So I asked the angel and said, "Sir, what are these?" The answer is sent to me. These be they that I put off the mortal coffin and put on the immortal. Oh, that's talking about that's talking about Lord, us. That's talking about the elect of Israel. Cause we put off the free that again. It said we put off the mortal clothing. What's the mortal clothing? It's all the cares of this bullshit world. When you caught up in the filth of this world. You know what I'm saying? You out here calling yourself an American. You calling yourself, like we said earlier, a Moor. You calling yourself a Met. You calling yourself a Christian, a Baptist, a Catholic. All that bullshit. When the scripture said we're Israelites. Go ahead. It says, they put on, 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 Yeah, he's gonna, he gonna give us that crown. In the chariots, we can be in the same. But yeah, especially we, uh, you know, that's what the body is. I said that in front of him. This, uh, this truth is good. This I hate it when it does that. I'm sorry. This truth is the start of a uh, spiritual power. Especially when the chariots can be built. I'm saying, I'm a fool. Because of the sin. The spiritual body. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Power. And that's true. You know, uh, when you look into that word crown, you know, it really comes from the Hebrew word Quran, which means a horn. You know how the scriptures talk about a horn will be exalted? You know what I'm talking about? Same here. You know how the Bible uses the word horn as a power, right? Like a horn will be exalted. That's where that word crown comes from. Word crown. Yeah. That's what it means. Right. Like a horn will be exalted. And that's where that word crown comes from. A horn. I know there's a bunch of them. I can't think of one on the top of my head. It said, this one about the, the crown of the righteous shall be exalted, but the horns of the wicked shall be cut off. I'm going to look it up. It's the picture. They show the picture and everything, man. And it looked like some unworldly, out of this world type, you know, because some, some only you how shall be right. It was all gold, man, all gold. So hard got it on his page. You see, go to his page. He got it on there. They said from three to five thousand miles in diameter, just hovering, man. It's crazy. That's crazy. So it has to be only gods can get on that, man. Yeah, you can. God, man. Yeah, you. <laughs> You, you see what they say what happens when astronauts when they go to outer space, they come back to the earth, their bones are all brittle. You know what I mean? They lose all kind of weight. We're not designed we're not designed to live up there. They lose bone density. Yeah, that's what it is. They don't belong up there. That's right. Because there's more food. You know? Just like a bird got different bones than us. It can fly, you know? Different flesh. Oh, let me go back up. Let me go up. Okay, first one back to first, we're going up to first one, 39. All flesh is not the same flesh. Yeah, all flesh is not the same flesh. Hey, look, you got different flesh on the earth. You got, like a tiger or a lion got one kind of flesh. You see, it, uh, lions and tigers got superpowers. They're like incredible hawk compared to us. You know what I mean? You see how strong a motherfucking tiger is? You can just see the muscles. How much they weigh? They weigh like a ton or something? 
A tiger? Let me see you pick up a tiger. A 500 pounds. That's a big motherfucker. It's not a little heavier. It's not a little heavier. Yeah, that's heavy as hell. Shit, look at that elephant. Lions too. Yeah, that heavy. Yeah. yeah. It weighs almost as much as a little car. Yeah, lions is a little leaner. More, 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 more superhero. Tigers are more bulky. Yeah. You know, lions fight. More athletic than tigers. Lions fight different than the rest of the cats too. They like to charge it. Lions mates. Tigers like to box. Lions are like to rush it. Lions are mates. That's an they amazing really creature. Are. Though, so they really is. Just think of that mind that take the that type of mind that, has, that creates that type. Of, and just that that, type, and in the kingdom, our children, we're gonna be taking lions for a walk down the street. Yeah, what's up, man? Yeah, we're gonna be giving our kids. Yeah. Too. A little bit all little, kind of cats. We're gonna have little lion kittens, yeah. little lion, you know what I mean? They're grown ass lions. Right. A little riding on a lion. Look yeah. my daddy. Look yeah, at my lion. Pit bulls are nice though, but this is how you know. That's Jake. Yeah. This is Jake. It says all flesh is not the same flesh, but there is one kind of flesh of men, and another flesh of beast, another of fish, and another of bird. All different flesh. What's up, bro? Where did you get that book, bro? I used to have one. I got the action TV when I was in the military. And it was an all black one. Uh, you know where you got that? Surplus. Check that Probably cousins. Army, Navy thing down there. Yeah, down on campus. This one. Uh, this one of the more show too. This is the first one. I miss that book bag, man. Yeah. Yep. Well, you, can get, you can get cheap once you get good with the price. What branch, bro? What, what branch was you in? That's not in the military. I, I tried to do Marines, but. Uh, they wouldn't let me in because I had so many traffic convictions. There. Really? Yeah. Marines don't play that shit. I was in the Marines. Right. You still got that thing on your neck? What is it? What's wrong with hey, that? Hey, hey, yeah. Oh, I didn't. Yeah, he fucked up. Oh, I got a scripture I was looking for. Psalm 75 and 10 says, All the horns of the wicked also will I cut off, but the horns of the righteous shall be exalted. Now, horn that represents our power. So, when, when, like, that's that crown. So, when the Lord gets to that crown, He's going to give us that power. He's gonna give us that immortality, and we're gonna rule all these nations with a rod of iron. It ain't nothing they could do about it. We could be living in giant, lavish castles, bro. Or who don't even know what kind of shit this cat? We gonna she gonna put in castles to shame. Oh, that's a good Jack Kirby created that. The funny thing about the immortal, they're separate from humans. Yep, they look at humans like they were inferior. Yeah, that, that's right. That was a, that's a good comic, bro. Yeah, that, that, uh, and, and the leader uh, name was Black Bolt. Yeah, right, right. Oh, yeah, that's what I say though. You know when they got yeah, a new they, cartoon, they, they, um, the Avengers fighting. Yeah, yeah, for real? Yeah, yeah, they're trying to come together. You know how the Avengers are so much against all the times anyway. Yeah. Well, anyway, it, the, it's dope, man, because um, uh, Black Bolt, he, he, he said he, he spoke, right? And it's, it almost sounded like, sound like he said the Heavenly Father's name, man. It's dope, too, because they made it. They made it. They made it sound good. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It's dope, man. It's dope. It's hard. Cause you know that was man. Jack Kirby created them characters. He said if he got all his ideas from the Bible. The immortals. The immortals. They like. See, it's just, it's just, it's just, it's just, yeah. You got all that shit. He said, "Why lie? I need a beer." That's true. I get you. Here, man. Coming out of the Yeah. Phone, should, drink, <laughs> should drink more water on this heat, though, boy. Being honest. All, all this hot ass weather for it. Actually, <laughs> that was a good time to drink. Got a little coolness. Okay, let me go. Um, yeah, that, that immortal shit, right? I forgot all about that, man. That was, 
I got some new old ones in the house. Well, verse 40. There are also celestial bodies and bodies terrestrial, but the glory of the celestial is one, and the glory of the terrestrial is another. All right, celestial means outer space. So the scriptures say you got terrestrial flesh, and you got celestial flesh. Like an angel is a celestial, a celestial being. Right? That's why an angel can travel around in outer space at the speed of light, going in between dimensions. A human body cannot survive in outer space. An angel don't need no space suit. Like his bones don't lose density. An angel probably ain't got no bones. You gotta take a test and everything. You gotta take a test. A physical test, but, a mental test. But when the Lord returns, he's gonna give us power. And we're going to be able to fly through outer space. Like we the silver surfer or something. You know what I mean? We're going to be able to control the elements. Yeah, yep. Just like God would lure to control the elements when he was keeping the masses. I can't wait to just glide through the galaxies. You know what I mean? I can't wait to just, just, just release Good, their girl. power. Release my anger, man. All that anger, all that frustration, man. We're going to be able to put it into one thought. All that, all this bullshit. Hey, going, going back man. to your boy Black Bolt, that's a good idea. Where he can't talk, but when he talks, he, every, he kills the motherfucker. You know, all, you release all that anger, you just, ah! Kill a motherfucker. Um, I'm going to go back down now. So crispy. Where are the heathens at today? The scoffers. Scoffers taking time off today. Yeah, they gonna come out here. I said, yeah. For this corruptible must put on incorruption, and this mortal must put on immortality. So when this corruptible shall have put on incorruption, and this mortal shall have put on immortality, then shall be brought to pass the saying that is written, death is swallowed up in victory. What exact scripture is that? 15. Oh, you got the precept where he's quoted? Yeah. Oh, you get that. I was about to get it too. Death is swallowed up in victory. Death is swallowed up in victory. So that's, the point. that's what we're working towards. That's that point we're working Everlasting life. We're gonna be the immortals. And it's literal. This ain't yeah. Pastor Porkchop giving you his bullshit ass lectures. You know? <laughs> you don't know what the hell he's talking about. So you don't go into it. I'm, I'm part of a bunch of different whacked out groups on the internet, you know, where you go and debate people. But there's one, they posted this meme that said, uh, Christ never said he was coming back. He said that the Christ consciousness was coming back in you. You know what I mean? They try to say, oh, you're not supposed to take it literal. Right. Well, he did say he is coming back. Yeah, he said he, he said is coming exactly back, back out of the clouds with, with chariots. Right. He said he's coming back to get us, like when he was talking, the part, the scriptures when uh, talking about that many houses in that, in that, yeah. in that, in that verse. He, he said, said he's going to prepare a place for where us. Where I am, you shall be, or something like that. You know? It is literal. There are things in the Bible that's not literal. Exactly. That's not one of them. Is that people don't understand the cherries. How do you explain the UFOs? Y'all got an explanation for that? Yeah, uh, yeah, because the UFOs go right in hand in hand with that spiritual power. Like you said, we can't fly in them without that power. Go ahead. Isaiah 25 and 6, the point is 8, 25 and 6. And then in this mountain shall Yahweh of hosts make unto all people a feast of fair things, a feast of wine of the needs. A fat thing to pull a barrel of wine and He will destroy in this mountain the face of the covering cast over all people and the veil that is spread over all nations. He shall, uh, it's like he will swallow up death and victory. Yeah. And the Lord God will be away. He shall he will swallow up death and victory and the Lord God will wipe away tears from all, all faces of his people shall he take away from all the earth with the power of spoken. No more this oppression, period. No more this inner bondage, period. <laughs> Again, the word of the day is literal. And that's literal. <laughs> damn it. That's literal, God you, damn it. Did you already read 1 Corinthians 15? Yeah, that's what I was just saying. Oh, okay. Cause you, yeah, there's more to it though, yeah, right? Yeah. All right. Yeah, I was remember I was going back and forth. All right. What's up, man? What's up? What's up? Here you go. 
Yeah, we teach teaching the word. That's man. good. We teach teaching the correct people. That's good. You know, correctly. I need a word right now. You do? Yeah. yeah. That's why we out here. I just man. found my girl. She just went to the ATM with my fucking bank card. Oh. When I told her, I asked for the card last night. Oh. She gave it to me. But I put it on the dresser. Then she went and took it and left. Okay. And I just left the bank, and I got a printout all of the fucking bank, all the transactions. She just took two hundred dollars out the fucking bank. Right, right. And told me she didn't have the card. Right. And this just happened like in the last half hour. She younger than you? She's twenty nine. Oh, you know you shouldn't leave them young girls alone, man. Well, I got to <laughs> go. You hit them and leave.